So that the technicians will draw a blood sample from Monty for a pre-anesthetic blood test to make sure that he's healthy enough for anesthetic. Prior to surgery, Monty is given an injection of pre-surgical pain medication. This medication acts as a sedative and a preemptive pain medication. It also helps prevent anesthetic complications. Once intubated, Monty is prepared for surgery by shaving the surgical area to remove all the hair. Once all the hair is removed, the technicians perform a surgical scrub to disinfect the skin prior to surgery. While under anesthetic, Monty is monitored both by a technician and a surgical monitor that monitors heart rate, blood pressure, and oxygen levels. For neuters, Dr. Claffey uses a surgical laser which cauterizes the blood vessels, reducing bleeding and swelling. It also cauterizes the nerve endings, reducing the pain response. Through the incision he has made, Dr. Claffey removes the testicles. Using the laser as well to cauterize the nerves and blood vessels. Once both testicles are removed, Dr. Claffey closes the incision using a suture material that's designed to absorb into the skin, so Monty will not need to come in for suture removal after surgery. Once surgery is completed, the anesthetic is turned off Monty is left on oxygen and continued to be monitored while he's recovering. After surgery, Monty is given an injection of Medicam, which is a pain medication, so he's completely comfortable while recovering. And just 15 minutes after surgery, Monty's already starting to wake up. He will be continued to be monitored for the day by the technician while he's recovering from the anesthetic as he will be fairly groggy for most of the day.